Welcome back to Sports Wrap, and it's certainly an honor to have the boss here of the football program, Coach Amstutz. And, and Coach, thank you for your time. I know it's a busy time. Before we get into things, I got to ask you: Are you? I think you and Bruce are going Hollywood with these bobblehead commercial <laughs> spots. They get better each time. I kind of like it. Well, it's been a lot of fun, and yeah. uh, Bruce and I. Bruce is a good sport about yeah. it. And uh, whatever it takes to sell a ticket and uh, entertain a little bit, we'll do it. I think you guys can hit the road with that show. <laughs> I, I, I think it works. All right, Coach, let's get right to it. Uh, Thirty-six and fifteen last four years, nine and four last year. Coach, we talked a little bit off camera. Every year. You know, the Rockets have an outstanding team, and you're playing for a championship, and that doesn't that isn't normally the way it goes in major college football. You know, you have your good year, you have your off year, you reload, you come back. How have you been able to do that, Coach? Well, you know, we're part of a special program. I think tradition is a lot of it. Our, our players really, when they step on the field, they really believe they can win and will we'll give great effort. Um, I've been blessed with some really outstanding assistant coaches who have done a, a great job every year. And um, it's something really bigger than any one thing. It's something that uh, it's a belief inside of each of the players. Um, it's part of a tradition. And um, that, that uh, the players want to reach a higher level than they, they normally would on, a, on some teams. We believe we can win, and uh, it's been something special. Well, Coach, that's a great segue. That, you know, you've got two new coordinators, uh, one on offense, one on defense. And, and with that always comes – you know, change is a good thing, I think, in football. I really, I really do. You know, the constant trying to get better, change. What are the, let's tell the folks about the two new coordinators and, and what kind of changes do you think they're going to bring to the Rocket offense and defense? Well, I'll start with Tim Rose. Uh, Tim is an outstanding coach. He's been a head coach. He won a championship at Miami of Ohio. He's coached at Memphis, Minnesota, uh, Louisiana, uh, Louisiana Tech. Um, you know, he has a lot of experience. He's a really uh, uh, great person. Uh, the players love him. He has a lot of energy, a lot of positive energy, and um, he has a lot of experience. Uh, we're going to mix it up, and we're going to be a very multiple and, and I think a really unique defense. Um, we're going to mesh uh, a lot of the things he's done at different places and a lot of uh, Toledo's base off or, or base defense that we've done before and mesh it into a really unique package. So it should be a lot of fun. We talked to a few of your defensive captains, and they seem genuinely excited about the scheme, and the coach, and boy, you know how much of that is being a great defensive coordinator that you were at your years at UT. When you believe in the coordinator and you believe in the scheme, great things can happen to you. Now, what about on the offensive side of the ball? O offensively, John Shannon. Uh, John Shannon and Rob Spence have been right-hand men with each other, uh, going all the way back to Maryland in the early days of coaching. Um, so um, offensively, we're on the same plateau and on the same track we've been. Uh, we just have a new man in charge, a new guy calling the plays. But our, our offense, the base of our offense, is similar. And we, he, he will now John will build off of it in, in different angles uh, than Rob, but yet it, it, it'll continue. Well, and I had a chance to talk to Bruce in our Mac preview show, and, and Grad was talking about the big uglies up front, and he's real excited about those guys. And I know that is in your heart. You like those big guys up front. Let's talk about them, Coach. Well, well, you know, it always starts up front. If you want to have a winning football team, there's going to be some time you need a great offensive line to punch a hole in there and get that one yard. Um, the offensive line, I think it starts with Coach Devlin. Uh, Mike Devlin, who played 12 years in the NFL, he was a college All-American at Iowa himself. Uh, he's one of the guys in the trench. They really uh, rely on him to, to you know, set him in great schemes and to motivate him. He's done a great job. Um, and, uh, you know, they're meshing together. We have a few new faces in there, but uh, it, it's been going well. Coach, we, we've got about a minute left with you, but uh, two things. We had a chance to talk to the commissioner, Coach, uh, Commissioner Chris, with the MAC in our preview show and, and tell the folks, because he did too, how great the MAC is, uh, first of all. And then secondly, let's talk a little bit about your schedule. Well, you know, the, the conference, uh, I think, is getting stronger each year. Uh, the opportunity to play on ESPN – uh, is opening a lot of the doors. It's opening doors in recruiting players in New Jersey and Houston, Texas, and Fort Lauderdale, Florida. Yeah. They've, they've seen us play, and that's making a difference in our, in our program. I think our, our program uh, and our conference is getting stronger every year. And your schedule? Let me go through the schedule a little our bit. Our schedule, though. we have Western Illinois. It's our, it's our first game, home game, September 1st on a Thursday night. Um, the only other non-conference games we have are Temple at Temple in Philadelphia and Fresno State out in uh, California. And Fresno State is a, a legitimate top 15 team in the country. Um, they, they beat Virginia in a, in a bowl game, and they're outstanding. Coach, we so much appreciate your time. We wish you nothing but the best. And we know the Rockets are going to have another great football season, Coach. Thank you very much, Tom. Thanks, Tom. We'll be back with more Sports Wrap on the road.